OK, so let's have a quick look at exactly why every marketer needs a system like WP Smart Links. Now, we all know social media sites are important, and we also understand that being able to share our affiliate links and promotional links on those social media sites is essential. But the social media sites won't let us share all the links that we want to. Sites such as JVZoo and Warrior Plus, their links are often banned by sites like Facebook. So let's actually have a look at an example. For this example, I'm going to use Facebook Messenger, but it's exactly the same when you're posting links on your Facebook profile or other people's pages as well. And all I'm going to do is paste in my quick message and a link for someone that I'm sending a link to on Facebook Messenger and then click on send. And there we go. Straight away, it pops up with a message saying, you can't share this link. Your message couldn't be shared because the link goes against our community standards. There we go. We cannot share our promotional link for JVZoo for a product that we like. It's actually one of my own products, uh, a caching product, a good quality product. But because Facebook have decided that JVZoo doesn't meet their community standards, we can't share that link either as a private message or on other people's pages or even on our own profile. Now that, as a marketer, is a problem. So now let me show you the solution, which is WP Smart Links. So here I am in my WordPress admin area. Smart Links is already installed and I'm on the add link page. All I'm going to do is pop in the same URL, give it a name, let's call it cache because it's a cache plugin that I'm promoting. Click on the grab data from the primary URL and that will fill in our extra bits down here such as the title, the description and an image as well. Uh, and right down the bottom we have in advanced settings you have the option to put in a tracking pixel so this is not just some link redirect it's a complete bridge page where you can have a, a pixel that pings when people click on this link so you can track that they have actually clicked on this link but for the purposes of this demonstration let's keep it simple and scroll back up and simply click on publish to save that link now take a second or two and that's it. We now have our new smart link. So I'm going to simply click on copy to copy that link and head back to Facebook Messenger. And now we can simply paste in that new smart link, click on send. Bingo. That worked. Facebook hasn't banned that link because it doesn't know it's a JVZoo link. It will end up going to exactly the same page, but it has a bridge page in the middle. So it disguises the link, but still gets the prospect to the page that you want to send them to. Now that's in Messenger. Let's have a look and make sure we can do it on Facebook pages themselves. So here I am on one of my own pages. I'm going to post a comment. Uh, also use a good cache plugin because that's what this is for. Again, paste the link, hit return to post it. Now that comment has posted without Facebook banning that URL. There you go. You can see it's picked up the image and the description from our smart link. That's how powerful smart links are. As a marketer, you need to be able to share your affiliate links, your promotional links on social media sites like Facebook. Smart Links allows you to do exactly that and a lot more. Now, I mentioned earlier when we were setting up the link, there is the option in advanced settings for a tracking pixel code. So you can track exactly who has clicked on your links and then retarget them through your Facebook ads or other retargeting advert campaigns. We also have total control over how this information is going to show on the different social media sites. So I've picked uh, a graphic and the description. That's been picked up automatically from the page. But you can edit that information to control how it appears. You also have up the top here the option for smart link sub IDs, sub tracking IDs. And it's extremely simple to use. All you do is add a sub ID tracking word, whatever it may be, at the end of your link. So here you can see I can use Facebook or Twitter or any other platform to identify where the link has, is and where it's been clicked. So we can then see that in the reports for all our smart links, we can see where we're getting the most clicks. 
So for example, I've used the Twitter sub ID and actually done a post on Twitter using that particular link. And if I click on this, it will bring up the bridge page that we'll see. You can also see I branded this bit bridge page with my own logo. That is an option that's available in the settings and so people see your logo before they go through to your target site or offer. So if I now go back to the Smart Links plugin, there is the option to look at reports. Let's pull up the reports page and we'll see that for this particular link, cash, which is the only one I've got on here so far, we've got sub IDs for Facebook and Twitter and we can see how many clicks we've had on each of those sub IDs, giving me a very clear idea of where this link is actually getting clicks and traffic from. Now that is really, really useful for tracking where your traffic's coming from. So that's a really quick run through demo for you of why WP Smart Links is so important for marketers. It allows you to post your links on social media again and track where the traffic is actually coming from, from those different links and to actually pixel those uh, clicks as well. So very, very powerful marketing tool for your arsenal. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please feel free to check out more information below.